amazing dry grape making technology. Initially, all the leftovers of the prior season are cleaned by utilizing automated pieces of machinery that are built in tractor shape containing circular cutters attached with. Similarly, workers also clean the leftovers manually too. During the season, there's a process called leaf stripping, which is done by a machine that is used to dust off the specks of dust that comes through the wind. This process assists the plant with improved and better growth capacity. The cultivation of grapes is also done in a linear manner to ensure smooth operations for the workers with sheer discipline that ensures better efficiency. The grapevines bestow fresh bunches during September to November and become ready for harvesting in northern climates. While for the areas where there's a dry atmosphere, the farmers ought to cover the plants to save them being dried. But after the plucking of the fresh bunches, after completing a certain duration, the grape bunches are washed by emulsion and kept in sunlight. Don't forget to hit that red subscribe button if you want to watch similar videos or if you're obsessed with farm and technology related videos. Give a thumbs up to this video so that we can know that you're supporting us and valuing our efforts. Apart from the manual plucking, the canes of the plant are cut through a mechanized cane cutting machine. Similarly, a similar mechanism is used for harvesting to collect the bunches that reduces the time and saves more bunches that get wasted due to manual labor work. The trunk is then unloaded for filling drying trays for dehydrating the grapes. Another machine is used for riddle machine stick removal, that is, for separating every single piece of grape, and ultimately, the grapes are lifted to the automated processing plant. Keep watching! A quality inspection also becomes effective on the arrival of the grapes who inspect the quality of the grapes and screens the ones that fail their standard quality test. This is how the grapes become ready to be packed in packaging to be sent to the market that is further used in various processes. The automated robot performs the loading of the grape cartons. Dried fruit factory process. Up next, we'll be presenting you with the process of dry fruit making that you and we usually purchase from the supermarkets and department stores. It takes very little time for the workers to produce items that are based on dried fruits because nature has already prepared the fruit and made it dry. 
Now all they require is to pluck the fruit and make its approach to the factory while sending it to a series of short processes. The only hassle they feel is the product line and the determination of the perfect quality of the fruits because the stale fruits can devastate their overall hard work and contaminate the overall quantity. The fruits are initially plucked manually by laborers and they're collected in a basket. These plucked fruits are then carried and taken to the factory with tiny loading machines where they receive a central cut and are laid off on the trays to get them dried. The fruits are kept on the escalator to take them for further processes. Meanwhile, the quality inspector ensures their quality too. A tremendous quantity of them is packed into boxes, which are prepared for those who ask for the same fruit to be used as a raw material for their products. Similarly, the same fruit is also prepared in liquid form and then dried and cut into several smaller pieces and packed as a sour product that is seen in the supermarkets and general stores. Furthermore, a huge quantity of the same fruit is ground that is further used to produce jelly balls from then that have an integrated taste of sour and sweet. For those who love to consume the fruit as it is, the factory also packs them into plastic packaging to delight their customers. This factory produces a variety of products that bestows distinct tastes to their customer throughout the year because they receive their raw material from nature that never curtails the supply, but yes, gives a variety of tastes each throughout the year.